does that mean? Where is that sound coming from? It gets worse every night. Upstairs, I better go check. A diary. Now I remember the reason I came to my parents' house in the first place. The diary that I usually wrote everything but I don't remember where I put it. That's why I came here to search for it. I thought that maybe if I find it, I can finally find some answers. Then the accident occurred and I lost my memory. I have to find that diary. Why is the light still off? <laughs> Sophie, was that, was that really? Really you?
parents' room. I haven't been in this room since their death. I just can't accept that they really are gone. It just doesn't feel real and right. It feels like they are still in this room with me, watching me. A damn, ugh, my head. It hurts. Sophie are, ugh, my head. Are you in danger? Possession by a wicked entity is an unusual or an that's, altered state of consciousness and associated behaviors my father's voice. which are purportedly caused what by the control of a human body. The entity, though, hungers for more. In these cases, possession is the first step of a demon's plan. It is said that there are those who return to our world, possession? seeking to resolve unresolved matters from their previous lives. Things get much worse for the host from the moment It's already too late. When a demon attaches itself to a human being, it becomes a parasite of sort. If you want to break the link, I'm afraid this isn't a simple matter. The best way to do that is to obey and help the demon find what it seeks. In the first stages of possession, the demon manipulates its host with visual hallucinations and voices in the mind, destroying the sanity of the host. This is how demons fully exerts its insidious control. I don't... This, this can't be true. I'm... I'm not possessed. I... I... Better go to sleep. What is happening? Why is this happening to me? I am back at the basement, but it doesn't make any sense. I, I don't understand. What is happening? Are those police tapes? What happened here? Wait, something is wrong. This radio wasn't here before. Recently, there was a brutal family killing. The brutal killing took place while the family was gathered at home on Saturday afternoon. The girl heard screams and immediately called the police saying, while she was upstairs, she heard stabs and everyone downstairs screaming. 
After a while, when the police arrived at the place, the parents of the girl were found already dead on the basement. Her dad was hanging from the ceiling and her mother was found dead on the floor with a lot of stabs, while she was found passed out in a bedroom with a stab in her stomach. While the other person's parents that were with them were nowhere to be found, the murderer seemed to got away. The girl's name was Sophie. The police are still investigating this crime. What? A, a murderer? What is happening? Th this can't be real. Was Sophie's and my parents' death really? I, I, I need to find out more. So, Sophie, is that you? wasn't Sophie. Her eyes were black. It's as if something was taking control over her. I must find her quickly. A gap. Maybe I, I can squeeze through. Instructions? here in the first place. What is going on here? How did that door bring me here back to the house? And that thing, is it finally dead? Am I finally free? It just doesn't make any sense. This doesn't feel real. Am I being manipulated? Am I really cursed or... thing that's for sure. I must save Sophie. Whatever it takes, whatever that is, I must save her. A curse is any expressed wish that some form of adversity Curses. or misfortune that will be what is happening? Or attached to one or more persons. In particular, what does my father have to even do with this? Demons, curses, what is happening? Entity 
or a person that died with hatred for someone or a lot of deceased that died with rage. In order to break a curse, well, I'm afraid this is no simple matter. There are lots of kinds of curses and ways to break them. The most common way to break a curse is by exercising the entity or person that put on the curse on you. While it may seem hard to do since the person is dead, in order to do so, you have to summon the being that put the curse on you and exercise it. Side knot, killing it won't work. The curse will remain since the entity or the person hasn't been exercised yet. To summon the being, you have to do some kind of ritual. In order to do so, there is another tape that explains the way and what you will need. Good luck. I have to find that tape. Where could it be, though? I have searched the whole house. I didn't even find the diary. Then what am I supposed to do? Wait. There is one place that I haven't searched yet. The attic. How could I forget? feeling dizzy.